All right, so today I found some winged sumac. It has these pointy type leaves. And you see those ribs in between the leaves? The little wings, that's why it's called the winged sumac. And it produces these red berries. And early summer, you catch them when they turn red and they're sticky. And you don't wash them off. You just make sure there ain't no bugs or dust or dirt on them. And you can uh, soak them in warm water or set them out in the sun and make a sumac aid, like a lemonade. And it's very tart. And, you can... and also they contain tannic acid. So do not boil them or else you will get that tannic acid. That's why you only want to make them in the sun. They contain some minerals and vitamins. Also, people, when the seeds get dry, you can take them and put them in a pepper mill and grind them over your chicken or other foods, and it gives them the lemony tang. All right, we're gonna go. I'm gonna go take some and soak them in water, and make some sumac aid. You also may want to filter the juice a couple of times through some cloth or something like that because the seeds have tiny little hairs that could irritate some people's throats. You can always be careful, be 100% sure of what you're doing. All right, so I'm taking these winged sumac berries and putting them in this jug. They're very sticky. We got the, all the sumac berries in the jug of water out in the hot sun for a few hours and see if we can make some sumac aid. All right, so I took the seeds or little berries from the winged sumac tree and put it out in the sun and made this sumac aid. It's like pink lemonade almost. It's really sour. And I took and I strained some into this glass bottle and I put it in the refrigerator so you get it nice and cold and I put like one spoon of sugar just like you would with lemonade. And let's see what it tastes like. Kind of refreshing. Kind of like lemonade, but not. Alright, so that's tangy. Don't forget to click like, subscribe, and go outside.